Mommy, we just need y'all to... can stay, but he can't stay. Why not? Like, we're, we're I, I don't understand. Like, this is my, like, we are family. Like, I understand, okay. like, this is your house, but, like, I'm not leaving my family. So, what you expect me to do? Oh. I don't know what you going to do, but <laughs> you just can't stay here. What's up, guys? Welcome back to The Vibe. It's your boy once again. With another episode of Epic Foolery. Now, everybody has this. Everybody have a family member that spend their money on their things and always want to come back home when their money runs out. So basically, a bum. Everybody have some bums in their family where they're always coming back home. Now, in this case, we got a couple with two kids for some reason, they don't want to work, but thought they should move in with her mother. How, how, when, when we start doing that? So I want you guys just to buckle up and watch this stupidity as they try to manipulate the mother to letting the doggone boyfriend live in that house. This shit, <laughs> make sure y'all hit that subscribe, like, and share. And definitely hit that notification bell because I'm be kicking out some more. But this, this is this the worst. This is the worst. And dudes, you know I'm always on y'all's side, but not this time. No, not even close. Check it out. I don't think this is fair. Like I understand this is your house, Ms. Lee, but I don't think this is fair. I know it's not really all his fault. We just can we stay here, mommy? Can we just y'all can stay, but. He can't stay. Why not? Well, we're, I, I don't understand. Like, this is my, like, we are family. Like, I understand, okay. like, this is your house, but, like, I'm not leaving my family. So, what you expect me to do? I don't know what you're going to do, but <laughs> you just can't stay here. She, her and the kids can stay as long as they like. But Sean is a part of the family, so he got to, so he got he to gotta stay at a hotel? Like, what? I, if you're trying to follow him, I suppose so. Like, no, I don't think that's, that's, Are you recording this? Don't record this. No, man, because that's bogus. That's bogus. Like, I ain't finna cuss in this your house. I, I want to get loud. I ain't about to do that, but that's just. Okay, so. I, I'm, I'm having a problem with this. I'm having so many problems with this. And evidently, the lady does not live with a man. All right? There can't be a a daddy there, a boyfriend, someone, a male in that house because there's no way this dude would show up demanding that I allow him to stay in the house that I'm paying for and catching an attitude about it. This is what I don't understand. He started out at the very beginning. I'm going to start it back, and I want y'all to just listen to his tone. At the very beginning, he starts out wrong. I don't think this is fair. How, when did you get fair in my house? That's See, that's the kind of stuff I, that gets on me. When did you start paying bills in my house? And, and tell my it ain't fair. Look, I want y'all to pay attention to him. Look, watch. I don't think this is fair. Like, I understand this is your house, Ms. Lee, but I don't think this is fair. I know, it's not really all his fault. We just, can we stay here? And now look at the daughter. All this, it ain't his fault. It's this and this. These two do not have a job. Why both of you are unemployed? All right. Now the whole thing is they've been evicted. And they packed up their stuff and came directly over to the mother's, the girl's mother house. Hadn't spoken to the mother, just showed up with two kids and Luggage. Like who do who does this? Um, we just y'all can stay, but he can't stay. Why not? Well, we're, we're I, I don't understand. Like this is my like we are family. Like I understand. Okay. Like this is your house, but like I'm not leaving my family. So what you expect me to do? I don't know what you gonna do, but <laughs> you just can't stay here. She. 
her and the kids can stay as long as they like. But Sean is a part of the family, so he gotta. So he gotta, he gotta stay at a hotel. Like what? I, if you're trying to follow him, I suppose so. And what they don't understand is, this woman is not gonna allow this man to stay there, and she basically supporting your man. Because that's what she'll be doing. It's the thing where, like, I'll tell my cousins or niece or whatever, I don't mind helping y'all out. But if a man is living with you, I'm not helping you. I'm sorry. But if a man is living with you, I'm not helping you. Why is he there if he can't help you? She has a grown man living with her, and y'all can't pay y'all bills to the point y'all getting evicted? And everybody know you don't get evicted on the 31st day. That shit go months before they evict you out. So this didn't just happen. And y'all showed up at our house. You guys hadn't paid in a while and got put out. And you probably got put out like the people on TV. I mean, online, where they put you come home and all your stuff on the lawn, you got evicted. That's what happened with you guys. Like, no way. No way, man. You bring that sorry mess in my house. Crazy. No, I don't think. Don't record this. No, no, man, because that's bogus. That's bogus. Like, I ain't even going to cuss in this your house. I, I want to get loud. I ain't about to do that, but that's just. Say that. I literally can't stay here. Like, I have nowhere to go. We all got evicted. Like, I know you're trying to say I'm the man. And I was supposed to take responsibility, but life happens. Like, I don't understand why I can't stay here, Ms. Lee. Stop. Stop. The questioning of why I can't stay here just keeps bothering me. I'm just, I'm just putting it in my perspective. If somebody come to my house, uh, one of my sons, their girlfriends or something, keep telling me why I can't stay here with y'all, with them in your house. Go to your own parents' house. You don't have no cousins, no friends, anything. And you standing here so proud of being the, the man of this family, but you haven't provided for anything. So how y'all been living, to be honest, with two kids? How y'all been making it? See, that's that's a little question. All that stuff that gets me. All right, I'm going to let it go. I know, but it just, this shit is ticking me off, man. Stop. I don't understand why I can't stay here. Well, we, maybe just for like a week. Just a week, maybe. And then. I mean, she just said y'all can stay as long as y'all need to, but I got to but I gotta. That's leave. what I'm trying to ask her if you can stay for a week. Just at least a week. So you don't have to be out on the street. Don't do it. So you don't gonna stay it. here, even though I can't stay here. That's what I'm asking you. You still need to stay here, and knowing I can't stay here. Where, where else is we gonna go? That don't. That's not the point, though. Like we supposed to be together on this. You finna let me sleep outside on the curb? I didn't say you can sleep. But I'm Let's see. Here comes the punk in it. Any other man will say, "You guys stay here. I'll find somewhere to go. Long as I know my family is taken care of." I'll be all right. If I got to go sleep in the car, I go sleep in the car. But this fool want the whole family to come out and be out in the car with him so he won't be alone. But see, you ladies keep picking these type of dudes, and then y'all get online and talk about all oh, these black men are like this, like that. No. The dudes that y'all choose, y'all choose these worthless dudes, y'all procreate with them, and then y'all sit there and talk trash about them after 10 years of putting up with the mess. She's sitting there begging for him to stay at his, her mother's house. He's sitting there demanding to stay at his her mother's house. Y'all understand? Now, if it was a dude, now if I walked around that corner and heard him saying something like that, oh, I'm going right in that jaw. Who you talking to, bro? You don't demand anything here. What you might want to do is step outside and keep moving. But see, there's no man around. So he's sitting there sticking his chest out at your mother. And you don't see nothing wrong with that. Like, y'all women are trip, man. I'm trying to get you to be able to stay here. You don't you don't want to stay here or not? I don't want to be somewhere where I'm not welcome. She just said I can't stay here. You know, she might change her mind. So I can't I can't stay here. Just for a week. Come on. I can't stay here, Ms. Lee. I I I, I don't think that's a good idea. Why what why? Uh, y'all made no effort or you didn't get a job or Let's see. Something so that y'all well, you know school just started and I had to get groceries and then my partner was due and then I had to pay the insurance so we just 
it just it just failed. I want y'all to hear this again. I want y'all to hear this. This is their excuse, basically paying their bills. All right. Paying your bills is the excuse. And then my partner was doing. Wait, 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 wait. And see. Effort or you didn't get a job or something so that y'all. Well, you know, school just started and I had to get groceries and then my partner was due and then I had to pay the insurance. So we just, it just, it just fell behind. A lot of things just fell behind. We just, it's not even probably even gonna be that long. I think a, a month actually first uh, for all of us just a month it's we'll, we'll stay. You just said a week. Yeah, right. just a week. Ago, but now you done change. It was a week a while ago. Now it's a month. And this woman knows if they get in her house, she can't she won't be able to get them out. That's what she knows. Cause it probably ain't the first time this happened. So mom's like, nah, I learned my lesson. I learned my lesson. And he probably argues all the time with this girl. So now this arguing up in my quiet house. I'm only changing it to a month because it's the end of this month. And it's going to take at least about two weeks for me to find a place. Man, I'm not going to argue. I'm not going to argue about staying here. I'm you know, I love it. you, but it, it's, it, it's just sometimes it, keep it on foot uh, effort or something to do better. <laughs> We did. Right. We did what we had to do. Like, we just put, this is like the money, the, the little money we do have left, we have to put all our stuff in storage. Like, this is all we brought over here. Like, like I don't understand why I got to sleep outside, why they can sleep in here comfortably. Like, I, it's already bad out here. Like, people out here killing people, like, robbing people, and I got to sleep outside. I just, his tone, man, is killing me. This fool said, I don't even understand. I got to sleep out. No, you don't have to sleep outside. You can sleep wherever you want. You just can't sleep in here. That's what he got to understand. You don't have to sleep outside. You can go sleep out there in the car. Most men would do that knowing that their family was taken care of in that house. They would sleep out in that car. They'll go to a shelter, go to a friend's house. But as long as he know my family's taken care of, I'll be all right for a while. We'll figure it out. I'm going to get a job. I'll come back and get you guys. But no. No, not soy boy here. Everybody got to suffer if I have to suffer. That's his mentality. That's why they in this predicament. Because you following a failure. That's why you in this predicament. Ladies, I'm pretty sure somebody told her, you shouldn't fool him. You should leave him. You should do better. But y'all don't want to hear that stuff. Everybody have one of these knuckleheads. Somebody's told you, you need to get away from this dude. But you won't do it because you in love. These emotions again. And he dragging you. Y'all got two kids and neither one of you work. How y'all going to make it? Living off family members? Mm -mm. Not raising no kids too? No. That's crazy to me, bro. Like, Nobody said you had to sleep outside. Where else I'm going to go? Where else I'm going to go? Nobody said you had to Where else I'm going to go, Sierra? We're trying, we're trying where else to figure I'm gonna go? this out. We're trying to figure this out. I understand we're trying to figure it out, but I don't understand why Ms. Lee is not letting me stay here. Like, I'm not, what is your reasoning for I really can't stay, but everybody else can stay? What you think I'm going to do? Oh, man, I wish I could just cuss that joke out so quick. Damn, I wish I was there. Well, maybe get a job and, and start... <laughs> Getting money saved yeah, so he that hear that. Can okay, but I have to have somewhere to sleep so I can go to a job. Like, I don't even have nowhere to sleep because you're not letting me stay here. I'm confused why I can't stay here. You're going to... So, it's, it's not going to be what, 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 what do you... Uh, I mean, is it, what's, what's the I'm, deep down issue? Is it like just because it's Sean or... Yeah, what, what is the issue? Please let us know. Well, this is not the first time things has been See? out of... Secret, stop, stop. See, I told you. I, I'm just the, saying, what? I told you, mom is not doing it again. They did it one time before. He was probably up in there sticking his chest out, arguing all the time, and not going to work. Probably hanging out, doing whatever, but not working. And the girl probably running around, taking care of these kids, doing everything. No, this woman ain't going to do it. But the way his tone is towards this mother is ridiculous. 
Like I said, but he know there's not a man in that house because there's no way, no way he'd have walked in that house and a man was in there and he was speaking that same way to that woman. He would be, yes, sir, no, sir, uh, sir, I'll figure it out, sir, because that dude would have told him, well, she can stay, but you can't. You understand, right? He would have shook his head, yes, sir, I understand, and went outside. That would have been the end of it. Wouldn't have been all this back and forth, why I can't stay at your house? Because it's my house. End of discussion. See you. I, I'm trying to get y'all to make better decisions with So the better decision is, is for me to be outside. Okay. All like Probably that. so. You, don't, you have to listen to her. Just I am listening, but I'm confused. But like, Because it's like not making no sense to me why I'm going to sleep outside. This is what I'm trying to get to you, Sierra. And you ain't behind me right now at all. Like, I am. I'm trying how? to get you to be able to stay. If you if you be quiet and just listen, I'm trying to get you to be able to say she's telling oh, us. She's God. talking and you keep interrupting her. <laughs> like, because she ain't getting to the point. <laughs> like, mm, Get to the point where we so this is so asinine. Ladies, how can you be with a dude like this? I'm all about my my guys, my bros, all that, but I'm all about us being what we're supposed to be. This is not what we are. My sons came in here acting like this, or one of their girls told me he was doing, man, they know what's gonna happen. We're gonna be pulled in the room, we're going to have a long conversation. They already know, you better not act like this. You want to have a family, you better be ready to take care of it. Period. We don't mind helping out here and there, but both of you not working, and then coming up in here telling me what I'm supposed to do? And that ain't even his mother. I bet you they're not even married. I bet you they're not even married. And you ain't here demanding her mother let you stay in her house. Like, shh. All we need is like a month, I think. Like just a month. For just all of us. Y'all gonna stay for a month. I'm no, gonna you're stay. gonna stay too, right? Yes. No. No. See, you you making this you making I'm asking. I'm asking. Can or um, just a month. That's all we need. 30 days. Is 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 no, don't do it. Uh, I'm, don't I'm do it. Uh, uh, I'm gone. It's good. So where's we gonna go? I don't know where I'm gonna go. Bye, baby. Okay. So where are you about to go? You about I to don't just know leave? Where I'm about to go. So you about to just go? Come here, son. I appreciate you, Mr. I'm, I'm gone. Y'all, y'all, just call angry. me. Just, I'm not don't angry. Be. I'm not angry. I'm not angry, angry because, because we're still trying to have. Oh, I'm done with the he conversation. She just hurt. said I can't stay here. I'm not gonna be begging. To be somewhere I'm not walking. So then where you finna go? This fool was about to say, I ain't about to be begging this B. He was about to say it. But you know what? If you want to stay that bad, you need to beg. That's for doggone sure. Because no one have to let you stay in their house. I don't care what family member it is. But to throw a tantrum because you didn't do what you need to do. And now you need somebody to house you and your family and you short with your chest stuck out oh why I can't stay that's why because you done did it before mom ain't forgot when you got, you got a little smart with her here and there oh she ain't forgot about it she real calm and collective but she ain't forgot about it like nah he can't stay here no more baby I'm sorry <laughs> she already done told her this and she still showed up with him. I don't know where I'm finna go. I'm gonna figure it out. What That's you talking fine. about? Like y'all good? We just do like a month. Just no, y'all good. Y'all no, chill. Y'all stay here. Y'all get to take a bag off. They probably sleepy. They got school tomorrow. Like I'm not finna be arguing about sleeping well, in somebody's house. I'm saying it, it, you know, it ain't like mm. we got things all together maybe if y'all would have called or something before it, got it just it, happened it just happened i'm just, just gonna we literally just dropped everything off it's cool and it's cool i ain't I, it's cool i ain't you, tripping you are we're gonna stay here we're, you can no eviction just happened they cannot evict you out in 30 days 31 days they give you several months and then they have to serve you with an eviction with another 30 days and 
what, you had at least probably four months or five months to figure this out. And you guys decided not to because you don't have a job now. Neither one of you. So you tell me it just happened. You knew it was going to happen. But y'all waited for the people to actually physically come up and put y'all stuff outside because I know that's what happened to you. You just gonna like, well, we ain't going nowhere. You're gonna have to put us out. Well, they put you out. And then you show up at her mother's house demanding to stay in her house. There's a lot wrong with this, man. A lot on both of them. The audacity of the daughter sitting there trying to manipulate the mom and keep saying, he can stay, he can stay, he can stay. She didn't tell you no. That's where mom should like, look here, we'll just go in the room and have a conversation with you for real, real quick. And when you slap her upside her head, I told you, no. Now you can go, you can leave these kids here, and you can go be with him. Or you all can leave. That's how it works, man. Stay. No, I'm not finna stay. You are I'm gonna good. stay. I'm good. Y'all good. I got it. I'm out. You want somebody to feel sad for? Listen to all this. Wow, this, wow, this. My family can stay here, but I crazy. Why I can't stay? That's crazy. It's good. Now, it wasn't a long video, but it was so much in this video that just burned me up. How, even at the end, you heard how he was talking. How come my family can stay here, but I can't stay? That's that woman's family. That's her daughter, and that's her grandkids. Like I said, you're probably not even married to the daughter because she may have felt a little different if you was married to her, but you're probably not taking care of the family like you're supposed to. You're probably been bumming off the family. The daughter keep running to the mom to get money and everything else to help sustain y'all little lifestyle you're trying to have. But you got a nerve to get mad because I ain't let you stay in my house? Man, the world done changed out here. Well, guys, y'all let me know in the comments, what would you do in this situation? I mean, literally, what would you do? Now, I know a lot of you ladies like to say, oh, I, that's my door. I don't care. I ain't putting my kids out, this and this. But you got to understand, at a certain point, your kids will bring you down to, your, to their level if you're not careful. You, if they can't get their stuff together, you can't keep doing it. Because next thing you know, you're going to be sitting there getting put out your house. So it's either you learn or you just get out here and have to learn the hard way. And they very close to learning the hard way. Because just think if the mother was passed already, where, where would you go? What would you do? Well, guys, like I said, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this. And it's your boy, and I'm up out of here. Y'all stay vibing. Peace. And I'm out.